Kate Middleton's first Christmas with the royal family almost went horribly wrong when she found herself unsure what to give the Queen as a present. The Princess of Wales spent her first Christmas at Sandringham in 2011, shortly after marrying Prince William. It is well known that the royal family give each other gag gifts during the festive season. Notorious presents exchanged include a leather toilet seat, a grow-your-own-girlfriend kit, and even a shower cap which had Ain't Life a Be written on it which was given to the Queen. Yet when it was Kate's turn to join the family in Norfolk, she decided to ignore tradition and take a sentimental turn with her gift. While appearing on an ITV documentary to celebrate the Queen's 90th birthday our Queen at 90 the Princess spoke about how nervous she was to give her late grandmother-in-law a present. Please like and subscribe to the channel. She said. I can remember being at Sandringham for the first time at Christmas. And I was worried what to give the Queen as her Christmas present. I was thinking, gosh, what should I give her? I thought back to what I would give my own grandparents. And I thought, I'll make her something which could have gone horribly wrong. But I decided to make my granny's recipe for chutney. I was slightly worried about it, but I noticed the next day that it was on the table. I think such a simple gesture went such a long way for me, and I've noticed since she's done that on lots of occasions, and I think it just shows her thoughtfulness, really, and her care in looking after everybody. The princess also explained. The queen always leaves a little gift or something in their room when we go and stay, and it just shows her love for her family. The late queen had her own very unique method of Christmas shopping. Paul Burrell, the former butler to Princess Diana, told Closer magazine about the queen's holiday tradition. He said. Firstly, she has catalogs sent to her, and then the Oxford Street branch of John Lewis sends her a selection of almost everything they stock. There is a little shop set up in the drawing room at Windsor Castle, and the Queen can pop in and choose gifts at her leisure. Late at night, after dinner, usually around 10 p.m., she'll pop into her little Christmas shop and do some shopping. The Queen always chooses practical gifts that can be used never ornaments or decorative things. So she might pick some picnic plates, a tablecloth, or a couple of hand towels. Then they are wrapped up and a truckload of presents are ready to go to Sandringham. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel.